what's going on guys let's do this problem right here the question is asking three point charges of negative two micro coulomb plus four micro coulomb and six micro coulomb are placed along the x-axis as shown in the picture what is the electrical potential at p due to these charges so let's see how we can find this one so first thing we have to do we have to find the distance we know that uh, b let's say this is a this is b this is p so we have to calculate this distance from here to here and this distance from here to here so let's list all the charges first so q a is equal to negative to micro coulomb and q b is equal to 0 0.2 um, the charge is 4 micro coulomb 4 micro coulomb and q c is equal to 6 micro coulomb so we have all these three charges now we have to find the distance of these charges from the p so let's calculate the first one r a p r a p is going to be we can use the pythagorean theorem since we have these two distance we can use a pythagorean theorem to find this one so that's going to be square root of 0 0.2 square plus 0 0.2 square and that's going to give us the value of 0 0.283 meter 0 0.283 meter and here rpp rbp we already know that is 0 0.2 meter so we don't have to separately calculate we can regularly put it 0 0.2 meter and r this is c right c rcp is going to be same thing as rap because same distance 0 0.2 0 0.2 so that's going to give us the same value 0 0.2 square plus 0 0.2 square and that gives us 0 0.283 meter right now we have all these values now let's calculate the electrical potential to find this one we can use v is equal to k q over r equation since uh, k is going to be common for everything so let's find the net uh, net electrical potential we can use this we can take the k common and inside this one we are going to have q a over r a p plus q b over r b p plus q c over r c b and this this is going to give us the net electrical potential right so let's plug all the values k q a is negative 2 micro coulomb so let's put negative 2 over a p that is 0 0.283 plus q b is 4 micro coulomb 4 over 0 0.2 plus q c is 6 micro coulomb so 6 over 0 0.283 since all are mi micro coulomb so we can we, we we have to convert that one into coulomb to do to do that one we can multiply everything by 10 to the power of minus 6 and that gives us in terms of coulomb and k i can plug the value of k also that is 9 times 10 to the power of 9 and if you plug all the values in calculator you will get 3.072 times 10 to the power of 5 volt. volt so this is the answer for this question and let's look at the second question that is asking a sphere with radius of 2 millimeter carries 1 micro coulomb of charge distributed uniformly throughout its volume what is the potential difference VB minus VA between point B which is 4 meter from the center of the sphere and point A which is 9 meter from the center of the sphere so let's draw the sphere first so we have a sphere right here and they are saying that is uh, radius is 2 millimeter so it, this is the radius 2 millimeter maybe I draw it a little bit bigger okay so let's say this is our sphere 2 millimeter okay 2 millimeter right 2 millimeter and then they are saying we have a 
point B, which is 4 meter from the center of the sphere. So if this is O, there's a point B right here. And this is OB is equal to 4 meter. And also they are saying that uh, point A, which is 9 meter from the center of the sphere. So let's say this is point A. So that is 9 meter from the center of the sphere. The question is asking what is the potential difference VB minus VA. So let's see how we can calculate. So we know that V is equal to KQ over R. Right? Since we have the charge provided, we can calculate this one right here. So V B minus V A, that's we are what we are trying to calculate. So that's gonna be basically KQ over R A minus R R B minus R A. So here what we can do is we can take the KQ common since the charge and K is going to be same for both we can take that one common that's going to be 1 over RB minus 1 over RA and let's plug all the values 9 times here they're saying 8.99 so let's plug that one 8.99 times 10 to the power of 9 times 1 micro coulomb 1 times 10 to the power of minus 6 times 1 over RB is OB 4 millimeter is it millimeter or meter mm. so they have given in meter so we can just keep it meter right so 1 over 4 minus 1 over 9 and if you calculate this one let's see what we get so you can take 9 times 4 common denominator and if you plug all this value you got you will get 1.24861 times 10 to the power of 3 volts and that's going to be equal to 1248.61 volts so the electric this potential difference is equal to this value so that is equal to this value right here and that's how we do these kind of problems i hope you guys find this video helpful thanks for watching